Hey, welcome back to my merry band of adventure. Oh, that's... Bulwark is crazy and can teleport. That's the worst combination. And also, he has not made any moves yet. Uh, just kind of stalking us like a hunter stalking a deer. But you know what? We're a very large deer. Yep. The tables have turned. Fight your way across the land bridge as quickly as possible. They're on that side. Ask for advice. Make a shield wall. Push across slowly. Take her alternative route. Hmm. Let's ask her. She may be very angry, but she seems very grounded in stuff. Something tells me the warp can't coordinate the ravens. Let's tr let's do that. Ah, I see. Well, we don't really have her option. We can either go somewhere else or just fight across. Let's do it! The fastest way is the easiest way. That's what I say. Oh, these dudes are not in the fight. Not even Ivor. That's terrible. Okay, so we're gonna get our... Uh, okay. We'll have to think about this a little bit. There are a lot of slingers based on what they mentioned. And we need to have somebody who has a lot of attack power. Last time our problem became we ran out of ability to do damage very quickly. So let's take Juno out, even though she is quite amazing. And we're going to give this dude a shot. Okay, let's see if he is the strong. No, actually Ollie is the strongest attacker. Oh uh, boy, do I need spar? I might take him out for for change here. We're gonna put in Ollie, the apostate, and then Ivan. This will be our offensively focused party. And what we'll do is we may play around with the turn order a little bit. Actually, you know what? Give me one second. I forget who was the guy that we had. Is it Eric? Yes, Eric is the guy that we put. You know what? Let's do this. Which I want Eric in because he gives us a little bit of. Should I take Avon out? Is this going to be a, a wave battle? I wish you can tell if a battle before it start is going to be a wave battle or not. Okay, what does he do again? He explodes stretch, which seems to be useful in this cir circumstance. So we'll keep him. I kind of want to take Ivan out, but I also need to get him a little bit. You know what? We're going to take out Ollie. This might be a mistake. He's, he is our offense. Uh, but we'll, we'll give this a shot. And then let's see. Do we have the correct equipment? He doesn't even have anything. You don't have anything. Strength, crit chance, that's pretty good. You have break, that's pretty good. And one will per turn. Okay, so minus one aggro, plus two move, three X talents. Who doesn't have anything? You don't have anything. Let's give him the aggro. And then you and Eric. No, just you. We'll give her, we'll give him this. I think that should be okay. I don't think we have anything left over. We have this, but that's not particularly useful right now. What he has, I think, is a little bit better. The extra crit chance is better than one just one strength. In terms of turn order, I think this is fine. I want Eric to be a little bit ahead because he is a breaker. And Volgard is going to be our tank. Um, kind of want to move him last. Because then he can, we can get him to get in the way of people. So we'll take this approach. Maybe even after him. Because then 
No, okay, this is fine. Let's do it. That means it's good. <laughs> that could have been worse. That's all I have to say. So where do I want us? This? this is Axeman? Axeman, Axeman. Okay. I think I want to be on this side. There is a boar here, but most of these other dudes are not particularly dangerous. They do have battering ram. But I think we can take a couple of them down fairly quickly. And I, the biggest threat, I think, is him, but it takes him a while to get to, get to where we're at. So the Axemen are okay, but then, other than that, that's the boar. So we have a way of countering that. Alright. Let's start by... We'll put her... What is her range? I forget. Okay. I want her to be, spend her first turn zapping the boar. So that would disable him. Let's do be safe and put her back there. You are our tank. We're gonna start by having all of our people that needs to be together be together. He can move through, so you know what, let's do this. You're gonna act first, right? Yes. Not sure if I want to clump everybody like this. I want to get as far away from these as possible, and I don't want to clog that lane. All right, let's do that. Seems like a dumb thing. Okay, you first. Then you, then you. So the axeman doesn't go. Okay, the board does not go for a while. Well, actually, not that a while. So he is the only one before us. And he can definitely get to this group here. But he needs to spend almost all of his willpower to do that. So that's not too bad. So let's start by going here. Takes 3 power, but will do a lot of damage. Uh, 4 damage. Good enough. We don't have any reinforcement issues, which is good. We might... He doesn't have a whole lot of attack. He can bloody flail, but I think I will take it. Because Eric's job is not to do anything, except... Six? We do have a lot of willpower. It might be worthwhile to burn a little bit. You know what, let's do it. Now with Mogan, I can disable him completely. Yeah, that's fine. It's good enough. This dude will yeah, basically do a, not a whole lot. Exactly. See what I mean? That also blocked the board. I think this map is... Uh, I can't see the colors very well. It's a little bit annoying. Where's How far can the board go? He can reach my dude if he wanted to. But if I wanted to attack, I have to do something. Okay, let's see. Umbridge includes strength at the cost of armor. It takes one round, it affects all allies. That might not be the worst thing, but I might wait a little bit just so we have, uh, you know. I don't want this board to do anything yet. Let's go over it. Does that cost? It does. Hmm, okay. Who else? Ivan, you. You're disabled. You can't reach anybody. Might not be the worst to completely... You know what, let's do it. This, if the boar wants to reach me, he has to spend willpower. And that's not the worst thing in the world. We'll give us a little extra push. He's gonna go for it. Okay, that's fine. Not bothered at all. Oh, that does make him warping. Random effect per turn. 
also explode upon death. So is it just if they attack you, you just suffer warp? I don't actually remember how this works. Control stones. The impassable, okay. Let's mend. There we go, get everything back. That basically did nothing. coming up and you won't do a whole lot. All right. We don't actually have to spend our time this turn to Stonewall because nobody's quite so close yet. So I might want to go after this boar. Or I can hit him and reduce armor a little bit because I think somebody else can hit this boar. Let's do that. This will get us a little bit of armor off. He cannot go anywhere. Perfect. And now we can still hit the boar. We can also heal. If I do this, I think it will only be one damage. Is it worthwhile to do that? If I go over here, I think I might do two damage. Let's try it. That's okay. It's better than nothing. We still have time. At any point, we can summon our bear, but I'm, I want to wait a little bit. We need to, to go for the enemy armors. This group here needs to be disabled as soon as I can. Because everybody else is still stuck, so they can't really move. Which is, our, which is the good news. Okay. And I don't want to get any closer. I might want to retreat. How far can you go? You can't actually reach anybody you wanted to. Maybe... Uh, hmm. I don't want to kill him, but I don't think I have anything else useful because this is all like cramped together. Okay, let's do this. You have Axe Storm too. That's interesting. So many options. I don't want to kill the boar. <sighs> They're so squishy. I'm too strong for any of these dudes. Just too strong. Can somebody else act before the board does? I even... Then the board. You know what? I kind of feel just... I want to kill him. But then that opens up this guy. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about this. Maybe I don't want to kill him yet. No, let's, let's kill him. Nope, nope, nope. But he explodes. Yeah, okay. I don't want to kill him yet. We have too many people too close. Ah! If he explodes, then... Let's, let's find out. No guts, no glory. Yeah, nothing happened. We're doing pretty well. Nobody's really seriously hurt at this point. And let me go ahead, go there, and mend him. So he should be back to full. Okay, great. Alright, so these dudes are gonna start coming after us now. So now it's my time to stonewall. I think two is enough. Not too bothered by that because that just blocks. And I might spend a turn waiting out, out the storm if you, you will, because I want these other guys over here to get a little bit closer, also him. So we also would like to get into a position where we can use our lightning storm next turn. Let's do this. What is his range for healing? He has to be she has to be next to somebody to do that, okay? Let's do that then. Swing her over to this side. This opens up this corridor for her to jump. Alright, so nobody has taken any damage. We have full healing. Don't want to walk through that. Okay, 
Can I go here and then here? Yes, I can. Takes a little more, but I don't go through the problems. And then we'll just hammer on him as well. Yeah. You can try. See you next time. Okay. Axe Storm. That's a range attack. So he's like, you know what? This is actually just Ollie. Now that I think about it, put him over here. Can I axe storm? Yes. Oh, I killed him. That's no good. <laughs> Glups. Wow. Maybe, uh, maybe it's time we get a little frisky. No, that's, that's not gonna work. These dudes are not sufficiently wounded. We're gonna try this. He's, he's going after that, but does it work? Yep, doesn't work. That, that ability is so good, oh my gosh. It is retardedly strong. Okay. Spend a little more time doing this. I don't want anybody to get hurt. And also, I want these dudes to get closer to me. There we go, that's what I'm hoping for. Wah! No change. We have enough willpower, we're just gonna spend on this. Oh, he... So, okay, he... If, if he stops... Not if he stops, if he... I, I lost my ability to speak. If he wants to continue that spell, he needs to not get hit. If he gets hit, then he loses the, uh, the ability. Get somebody else to move here, okay. I have a interesting idea. But that required Eric to move out of the way. Hmm. I'm gonna use my flash dance here. Minus one will plus one will to warp, so that will be one, two in that turn. I don't like that. That's a little bit too much. This is blocked, so I can't hit. I can't hit, right? Yeah, I can't. Somebody's in the way. Okay. If I move over here, then I can. But that seems like a waste of time. And also, that puts her in danger of this group, who's about to act very soon. That's fine. We're just going to... Hang back a little bit. Yeah, let's, let's go there. Ah, oh, don't do that. It's real rude. Where the heck next? So... I'm gonna plug this hole here. Wait. Maybe I don't want to plug that hole. Maybe I like the holes. I love them holes. I don't want to be in his range. This is what I'm thinking about. All right, we're now completely out of willpower. That didn't really do anything, let's be honest. Oh gosh, they're so feeble. Little, tiny little arms they have. I can one-shot everybody but I need to get to this man. He is our, our big primary target. I'm not playing this very well, but it's very easy, so it doesn't really matter. But I feel like uh, there's much better way of doing what I'm doing. So we could get, no, I don't want him to do that. I don't want him to be in, in target of anybody. So we're gonna just stop there. Cannot reach anyone, which might as well be the best solution. You know what? For him, I don't need to do anything. I'm just gonna wait. He's probably gonna spend time to. No, he didn't do anything. Okay, well. Oh, this Ivan's turn. It's like, why is he not doing what I want him to do? 
Let's try it. See what happens. Okay, that's not great. <laughs> mm. Regrets. Major regrets. Killed somebody shouldn't be killed. Well, you're down to six, so that's that's nice in a way. Then, who are you? I can't see where he is. You? This guy's dead. He doesn't exist anymore. I said five. So what about? No, that's no good. What about this? Not the worst thing that could happen. He's blocked. So I'm going to try to focus on... Oh, but that will get him in the range of... Okay. Two... Three... You know, I have an idea. Might not be the smartest person in this world. But I know why I see it. An opportunity. Just beautifully killed himself. Fantastic. Bravo. This is a incredible mistake, but I am going to go for it. Minus two. Terrible. Incredible mistake. He can't reach me, which is why I did that. In case you're wondering, like, why are you doing this? What's wrong with you? Nope. Not in range for anything. No, he is in range. He just has to go through the, the rocks, but I think we have a good option to stop him from doing that. Okay, we'll go here. Not gonna kill him quite yet. Oh. Not sure what you're doing there. Oh, bloody flail. That's fine. So that's the worst thing you can do. I think we should be okay. Yeah, that gives us extra. And let's throw some axe. Look at that. I I misclicked. Misclicked. But who cares? You're just dead. They're not dead, but you're dead. Did I mention you're dead? to do that, but that's okay. None of this matters now. Yeah, you doing six damage to me, huh? You think you're so cool. But what you don't know is you're dead. Goodbye. I get all these achievements. I don't know why. What a sad, sad sight. Or sad, sad man. Actually, can I? You know what? Okay, that's fine. At this point, I don't even—I don't even care. I don't even care. Good job. What a great party! Much better than the previous one. This is actually a fantastic party. Because of the nice balance between uh, attacking power and sustain. We have one physical healer and then we have one armor healer. We also have a backup healer in Napa State, which I think is how it works. And then we have three people that have shield wall. 
so you, you can potentially do a lot of really interesting things with them. But we're not going to demonstrate any more of them here today. It's fine. We followed your leader's orders. And since we're not out of danger, we're going to... You know what, let's, let's get to the next event point. Because I'm a little bit paranoid that we might not get saved. When we get to the next point, we'll call it a time. But I'm curious what's going to happen now. Ah, Skulkers. That's kind of rude. But that's okay. We're not going to call Peter today because we'll do that next time. Thanks for watching. I will see you.